Hello everybody, this is Ariane Arsenault from La Fée de la Mer and today I am making some moisturizing body balms. Uh, I have two that are already poured here and the one that I'm about to make is our um, fireweed vegetable based uh, body balm. So this is a an olive oil and fireweed infusion and the fireweed grows right behind the soap shop in the field. It is a wild harvest and we dry and infuse it in olive oil for over six weeks and then we strain it. Uh, included in this balm, we have a mix of vegan uh, vegetable based waxes. So we have berry wax and sunflower waxes along with kupuwasu and shea butter. Our shea butter is from um, Baraka Shea Butter. It's organic and it's fair trade. Our kupuwasu, argan oil and rose hip oils are from Paris Fragrance USA and they are all harvested sustainably uh, in the Amazon forest. I'm going to add to this a, a little bit of um, <laughs> vitamin E that will prolong the shelf life by preventing oxida oxidization, oxidation <laughs> of the oils and butter. So um, vitamin E is an antioxidant and it helps your oils stay more stable for a little longer. It also adds lovely skin benefits. To make this lovely, we have a blend of essential oils that are uh, orange fivefold, geranium, and elang elang. It is a very nice, heartwarming odor. I really love it. And then we're gonna get all of this melted down in the double boiler and pour in our cardboard, recycled and compostable jars. I also included some kai awe, I don't know if that's how you pronounce it, or ojon uh, oil unrefined, which is also from Paris Fragrance USA. This adds lovely hair loving and skin loving properties to your body balms. You will absolutely love it. Um, and now everything has been combined and melted down into my water bath. I'm just waiting for the temperature to Cool down a little bit before I add the vitamin E and the essential oils. Time to add the vitamin E. Look at the gorgeous color from this oil, butter, and wax combination. It is just lovely. It has a subtle orange hue uh, because of the yellowish tints of some of the oils and butters and the pink color from the rose tip oil. It's just lovely. And we are now ready to pour.
Our fireweed moisturizing body balms are now poured. They will harden up over the next couple of hours and we will be back to cap and label them shortly. You can see on the side here are the yellow ones, the calendula from the islands moisturizing body balms and these are the rose, uh, island rose body balms. And here are the finished moisturizing body balms. All that we do now is place the lid and stick the seal on it so that it can't be opened. And then we have these recycled craft labels that we um, just wrap around and these make a completely compostable jar for your body balm, which is amazing. Just goes right around. And voila, this is our Islands Fireweed and Geranium um, Body Balm. It has sweet orange fivefold in it, Ilang Ilang and Geranium. The smell is just so luxurious. I love it. And look at that bright orange color. There's no colorants in there. It's, it's just naturally this way because of the oils and butters and the waxes that we blended together. So um, if you like these, we have a couple varieties online. We have the Calendula, the Islands Rose, and we have, oh yeah, right here, we have the Islands Nettle uh, infused oil with acai berry oil. It's just beautiful. This one has lavender and palmarosa essential oils. So if you have dry skin uh, and need a little extra moisturizing, this is for you. Thank you so much for watching. If you like the video, please give us a thumbs up. You can subscribe to the channel. I would love it. And I will see you guys again very soon. Take care.